can recover off the home page in this lesson. So when you first log into the product, uh, the first thing you see when you're in Automation Center is your home page. And this is configurable on a user by user basis. When you log out, it will remember the settings that you previously had uh, before you logged out of that session. And on this home page, you can have a variety of content. Um, we provide a lot of content out of the box, and we'll show you in a minute how to add content. Plus, using our reporting tool, which we'll show in a much later lesson, you'll learn how that you can create your own dashboard widgets and then drop them on your home page. Um, like most widgets today, you can certainly move these around and uh, decide in which location you prefer them as well as you can interact with them as well so for instance here if I wanted to look at this piece of the pie I can click down and drill down and then of course I can just using my browser right click here and um, I'm back to this home page uh, we can also delete content from this page there's a refresh window as well should you wish to enter um, mittenly refresh it. You can also do this using the refresh option here as well. Plus you can add content. So for instance we'll go here and we'll select a gauge and uh, for instance we'll go here for activity and we'll get a list of held task instances and we'll hit select here and add it. Uh, once it's added to the page I can then decide where I won't wish it to be and presto it's automatically added. Uh, you'll also notice here that uh, there's uh, an option to switch pages. So the pa default page is My Automation Center. You can create your own pages. So for instance, if you want to have a My Automation Center view, but perhaps you may want to have uh, different views configured for you based on the type of workload you're running or based on the business processes that you're automating, you're certainly free to do that as well. You can go from two column to three column mode as well and then that will reconfigure the page and then you can drag and drop the content and have it in three column mode too. Um, if you then hit this button you'll, you're now down to uh, three columns here. So that's the home page. It's a pretty nifty way to be able to log in right off the bat and uh, see everything that's uh, critical to you. Uh, we also have uh, something called a dashboard here which is on the left hand side right under the Automation Center logo and this is a system-wide dashboard that's really available to all users within the product. Uh, this can be configured by administrators right out of the box. Uh, we've configured it with six gauges that we think are uh, statistics that we believe that everyone will appreciate. Uh, once again you can go in here and change it and then add any from a selection of pre-configured reports. So that's the home page. Um, certainly useful and um, feel free to experiment with it and create widgets of your own.